In today's phone tab, we call a guy whose car got towed. Uh Uh-oh. He went to the impound but didn't have enough money to get it out. So been there, too. So he's been scrambling, talking to family and friends, trying to come up with the funds. And you know you've got good people in your life (laughs) when they don't actually give you the money. But they will take the time to email a radio station (laughs) and ask for a prank call in your moment of need. And just so you know, they do have the cash. But before they handed it over, they wanted us to mess with them first. (laughs) It's your phone tap right now. Hello? Why, hello, friend. Am I speaking to a Jacob med, a uh, uh, med, uh, 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 med, uh, 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 med, It's, it's med, Yeah, that is exactly what I say. I say, that is what I did say. Oh. <laughs> Who are you? What is this about? Oh, oh, I am calling you today from towing. My name is Big Rick. I am the fella that towed your car last week. Oh. <laughs> You're the guy who towed my car? Well, I, I, sen- I sense a little hostility, friend. Now hold on here, okay? I'm here to, I'm here to help. Well, how, give me my car back. That's how you can help. Well, listen, listen. I heard you were here yesterday talking to Charisse at the front desk. You know Charisse. Yeah. Yeah, she said you could not afford to get your car out, and we had to keep it. Uh-huh. Is that true? <laughs> yeah, money's a little tight for me right now, but I need my damn car back. Oh, well, I recommend you do something because the cost is going up about $40 a day Ooh. at I least. I know it's $40 a day. That's why I got to get my car out of there. Yeah, well, Big Rick understands, and I am a very chair. Uh, I say I am a very chair. I, I, I will. I like to help people. <laughs> so I have a proposition. Are you on drugs or something? <laughs> well, if you consider sweet tea a drug, then yeah, <laughs> I am high as a kite. That's a joke. I'm just from the South. <laughs> so what are you proposing that we do to get my car back? Well, first, how old are you? You seem like a, you sound a little younger, like you got a little bit of youth up in that there uh, uh, meat locker. <laughs> Listen, I'm 35 years old, and what? I remember when I was 35. I was a gentleman about town, I'll tell oh. you what. What do you mean? <laughs> I was just prancing around, dancing with any lady who wanted to dance. <laughs> I'll tell you. Can you get to the point, please? I don't have all day. Well, look, if you would like to get your car uh, licking, uh, I say, uh, uh, l- 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 look at it split <laughs> with a highly reduced Price. Wank, wank. <laughs> You're hearing the wank, friend? Oh, what is this? I'm listening. God, this oh, is crazy. Okay. I'd like to introduce you to Clara Jane, my daughter. <laughs> what? She's a little princess of a doll. <laughs> a little doll princess, I call her. <laughs> what does this have to do with me getting my car? Well, let's just say she doesn't get a lot of dates, okay? Oh. Not a lot of gentlemen suitors hollering after her. What? <laughs> Probably because of the tooth. What are you talking about? <laughs> I mean, it is a little bit misshaped. <laughs> it's kind of entertaining and miscolored. So, I mean, that could be it. it. We don't know if it's an infection or what. We don't believe in Dennis in this family. What does this have to do with me? Well, I believe you would fancy her. Because <laughs> she looks just no like way, her dad. No way. Well, hold on, hold on. Let's hold your horses. I'm saying she looked just like me. Isn't that sweet? So you want me to date your ugly freaking daughter to get my car back? Exactly. That's the trade. Take it or leave it. 50 bucks, you get your car back right now, and you got a hot date tonight. Oh, oh. With Clara Jean and her tooth. Oh, God. I would say tooth, but she doesn't got a lot more of them. You're out of your mind. No, you're out of your mind if you don't want to join this family. Future son-in-law. Because <laughs> this is... I just want my car. Oh, well, I just want this phone call to end at this point because I'm running out of time and I got to play a song. What are you talking about? <laughs> what is going on? I'm sorry. This is actually Jose from the radio show Brick and Jeffrey in the morning. I'm doing a phone tap on you, man. Oh, God, are you kidding me? Yeah, that's not my real voice, if you couldn't tell. (laughs) Oh, my God, this is too much. Yeah, but your friend Greg set you up. Greg did this? Are you kidding me? (laughs) Yeah, he said your car got towed. You don't have the money right now to get it out. Uh, Sorry about that, brother. Oh, man, what a he is. Hey, do you want me to invoice him? Huh? Oh, that would be great. Oh, I got an even better idea. I could send him out with Clara Jane. <laughs> now, that's priceless. Am I right? 
Yeah, well, he's an ugly man, too, so they'd get along great. <laughs> <laughs>